redesign your website every two years to get a fresh alignment with search engines. Uh, this is tough. It's really tough. It's a tough uh, sell for us when we sell a website and say, this is your website for the next two years. <laughs> really, anytime, anytime you Everybody have- Everybody like wants to be, wants it to be like five to 10 years. Yeah. <laughs> Every time you have like an expenditure, it's a big creative project. Everybody feels on the hook to um, get it perfect before it goes live. Like you're going to destroy- the company, if you don't have everything exactly right with what you're doing with the new website and everybody in the company, you know, there are a lot of situations where everybody has an opinion about what it needs to look like, you know, what the headlines need to be. There's a lot of political stuff in companies that gets negotiated the with, a, with a website project. <laughs> like who are we going to put on the about us page? Who's going to be first? There's a lot of stuff that creates problems. And so what happens often is companies can go five, 10 years with a website and search engines have moved on. And sometimes these are pretty seismic shifts that can happen in a website, um, in a website's relationship with search engines. So here's, I'll just give kind of one example of how you can get left behind pretty quickly. And then I'll talk about kind of how to lower the threat level on this two year cycle thing. Um, number one, if search engines decide as they did October of 2019, Google made a real shift in the direction toward the mobile experience uh, as being the primary way to evaluate how good a website was. We called this mobile first indexing mm -hmm. because they had for a while two indexes running. And so they decided that they would judge all websites by how well they did on mobile in terms of the user experience with things that they could automate in terms of looking at how well it worked. And this meant that any website that was really good on a desktop, which is how, you know, people who, you know, had websites kind of thought of websites, it meant that they really needed to be pushed to um, rethink how they thought of their website and think of it first as a cell phone and not a computer. Yeah. And so um, that's that, a, that's that a hard a big shift. shift. That's a hard shift too, actually for designers and developers because they're hard on, for everybody because they're on a desktop and that's, that's how they do the initial. Yeah. I, I, I know a lot of designers where you have to go back and check their work because the mobile, ver they, they think in terms of like this, their screen, because that's, that's right. their work experience every day. Yep. But you're right. Most people are browsing on and you got to get it right on mobile. You yeah. just have to. So when I'm explaining this to people, I say the internet is a phone. The internet is a phone. Oh yeah, there's some computers on there too, but the internet is a phone. Yeah, And that's a good way to kind of shift perspective. So yeah, number one, you can have um, these big shifts. And if you don't have kind of built into your planning, hey, we're gonna invest and make sure that we're staying current. You can have kind of a seismic shift happening that, and you miss the boat on it. And so for, um, for that, we had 20 website projects come in when that update happened. Mm -hmm. And then, so second, the way to lower the threat level <laughs> is don't necessarily say we have to do a full website redesign every two years. Instead, what you can do is a technical evaluation that triggers either a complete redesign or site a, ba a larger batch of site architecture improvements and creative improvements. And so depending if you just, you know, got a new CMS in place and a new system and the kind of the, the underpinnings of the site good two years ago and your SEO expert says, yeah, they're still good, then you can probably stick with it, but you need every two minimum every year, really, but you need to do a technical review. Yeah. Awesome. All right.